Have you ever wondered what genetically modified foods are? They're organisms that scientists have tweaked in a lab, manipulating their genetic makeup through a process called genetic engineering. Picture a jigsaw puzzle, with each piece representing a gene. Scientists rearrange these pieces to enhance certain traits. You might be surprised to learn that common foods like soybeans, corn, and cotton often undergo this transformation. So why are foods genetically modified? Most foods are genetically modified for reasons like increasing crop yield or resistance to pests. But the big question is, are they safe? Let's delve into the main reasons first. Genetically modifying foods can enhance their nutritional content. Scientists can add vitamins and minerals that may be lacking in certain regions, helping combat malnutrition. Additionally, by tweaking a plant's genetic structure, we can increase crop yield. This means more food from fewer resources, a crucial advantage in a world with an ever-growing population. Lastly, GM foods often have a stronger resistance to pests and diseases, reducing the need for potentially harmful pesticides. Now on to safety. Numerous studies published on PubMed and other scientific platforms, along with most scientific authorities worldwide, agree that GM foods are just as safe as their non-GM counterparts. The World Health Organization, the American Medical Association, and the Royal Society of Medicine are among those endorsing their safety. While most studies indicate GM foods are safe, some people still have concerns. But how can you know if what you're eating is genetically modified? If you're concerned about consuming GM foods, it's essential to know how to identify them. In some nations, you'll find GM foods clearly labeled. Others, however, may not have such stringent regulations, leaving consumers in the dark. But don't fret, there are certain clues you can look for on product labels and codes. For instance, a five-digit code starting with the number 8 on your produce usually indicates that it's genetically modified. But remember, these codes aren't universal. They can vary from country to country, so it's important to familiarize yourself with the local practices. It's also wise to do your own research about GM foods. There's a wealth of information out there, from studies published in reputable journals to resources from health and nutrition organizations. Remember, knowledge is power. The more you know about your food, the better decisions you'll make. Thank you for watching this video.